Hello everybody, Stranger Gamer back for another match of my tournament. And we have a last 16 clash here, probably the clash of the last 16. Consisting of Spitfire against Ultimate Dino King. I think this, well... Based on the matchups, I'd probably make Spitfire quite a favourite here. Anyway, up first for Spitfire, we have Power Serolophus, Defense type, with a moveset of Egg Attack, Net Crusher and Kamikaze Tackle. That defense type, and this guy will have the type advantage over Ultimate's Dino. Anyway, backing up the power, we have Edmontonia, Crisis type, with a moveset of Stomping Hammer, Atomic Bomb, and Mole Attack. Questionable moveset, please, but it's paid off very handsomely. Winning Group C in an impressive display. A six game winning streak for Spitfire. I think it's six game winning streak. <laughs> But Ultimate's on a winning streak of his own. And as for Ultimate, we have Super Tana Reverse. With a moveset of Quake Saber, Earth Barrier and Technique Boost. I think if that Earth Barrier gets going, I think we could be in for a slog fest. Anyway, backing up the Tana Reverse, we have Super Metaborosaurus. With a moveset of Nature's Blessing, Tappy Jara Dive and Emerald Garden. If you can hear that humming in the background, that's my fan, because it's quite hot in here. And I think it's going to get hotter when these two face off. Anyway, this is probably going to be a slog fest, because this power is going to take no damage to this Talarurus, because of the type advantage. And this, but this, if this power gets off enough hits, it'll probably kill Talarurus in like two hits. Oh well, the Talarurus gets off a crit, and it's not Quake Saber, so it should do a decent amount of damage. No. <laughs> okay, that's once. Oh yeah, winner will face Toro in the quarterfinals. I forgot to mention that. And as the power gets off a kamikaze tackle. Well. If the last match taught me anything, it ain't over till it's over. We have a tie. Oh, he gets a Quake Saber, but uh, it'll be interesting to see how much damage this Quake Saber does. I think he'll do a little bit of damage, but I don't think he'll do too much. Let's have a look. Oh, there's a sizable amount of damage. Ooh, a support effect from Mataburasaur there, healing up the Talaburas. Well, this could be key for the match. If Ultimate can take out this power, the Mataburasaur will have the type advantage over the Edmontonian. He's got to get past this power first. Oh, and he's not. Well, not yet. As the Parasaur of us gets off a Kamikaze tackle, denying Ultimate Dino King there. Ooh, it's a poor effect from Edward Tonya! Which means the power will take pretty much no damage next turn. The next time this thing's getting hit, it takes no damage. And that time is now, so Ultimate will get off a swap. Ooh, and an Earth Barrier there, so Earth Barrier will be in effect when Tower Rose comes back in. Oh, that's a big hit from the Mataburasaur, taking out the Parasaurolophus. Oh my god, he didn't take it out! Oh my god! Man, that defense type is so good on this power. That's twice. Oh, well, he's gonna take it out this time. <laughs> no way this power is surviving. I think Spitfire's in a bit of trouble here. I think this ultimate has turned the screw here. And this turn could be crucial. Well, if not a Burrosaur, I guess it crits over. 
Wait, he's not getting it. He is getting hit though. Very impressive for the Dino King so far. But I wouldn't count. Oh, well, I was going to say I wouldn't count Spitfire out yet, but it's over. <laughs> well, commiserations to Spitfire. They fought valiantly and did very well. But Ultimate Dino King comes out on top and will advance to the quarterfinals to play Toro. Ooh, what a match that could be. Ooh, if we could see an Ultimate Soro Fagan after X semi, maybe? Well, we'll just have to, we'll just have to wait and see. And this is Stranger Gamer, signing out.